When you talk about intensity in preseason, I mean, they're preseason games, so you know they come and they go, but do you feel that as preseason progresses that that intensity sort of ramps up with each passing day, whether it's training or a game? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we know that you know we've got about a month left or so until it until it really matters, until it's uh, until it counts in the standings. And uh, like I said, I, I believe, and I think uh, most of the guys here believe that you know you, you train how you play. Um, and uh, these these preseason games, it, it's not like you're going to walk out on opening day and just all of a sudden be ready. It starts right now. I've been extremely pleased with. Um, uh, their ability to translate the messages that we've been giving them into training and then more importantly into the game. Um, very pleased. I thought they were sharp today. They worked extremely hard. Um, it's a good group. They're bought in. Um, you know, they have a swagger, uh, but they don't have egos, you know, so it's, a, it's, a, it's very much a team. And that's what we want to want to build here, a culture where guys roll their sleeves up, they work hard in training and uh, no one's bigger than anybody else. They all do the dirty work. They all want to attack, they all want to defend, and that's the only way we can play the way we're trying to play. I mean, a part of that is as a coaching staff, we need to gradually um, ramp them up. And uh, today was a day where we wanted to push a, a little bit, not only just physically um, with the demands we put on them, but also tactically and mentally. Um, wanted to keep a high tempo to mirror the game. Uh, and we need to get sharp. There are a lot of things, little details that we need to need to clean up. A lot of positives, uh, but we got to keep getting better. The game's about winning, and so every activity there needs to be a winner and there needs to be a, a loser. And we did some activities today as well, where your reward for keeping the ball is you don't have to defend, um, because we want to build that concept and idea within uh, our players and our our group. In the game, the better we keep the ball, the less we have to defend. But when we do defend, we need all 10 guys bought into it, pressing, fighting, scrapping, um, and they bought into it. Yeah, I mean, it's just, it's been intense. You know, we're learning a new style. Everybody is uh, gelling together. I mean, we're, you know, following the instructions, uh, getting new new ideas in the heads of all the players. Um, it's very exciting. I think uh, I think we're it's going to be we're going to show some show some surprise some teams this year for sure